Yo, what's up guys? Um, Crimson here. Sorry for the long break, but... <clears throat> excuse me. Um, I've had finals started a, a, a bit last week, and things have just been a little hectic around here. I apologize for the lack of videos. Uh, while I would normally bring you a Pokemon Sword Road to Masters, like episode 10, I think, at this point, um, I want to do something a bit more, well, easier. I, as you can probably tell, I'm not great at competitor battling. So, this is, uh, Let's Plays will be more common on the channel. Now, I will be trying to get a, uh, ROM to go for a different Pokemon game. But until then, you're, this is, uh... One well, of the only Pokemon games I can play at the moment and record, at least in decent quality, not amazing. But today I'll be starting a Pokemon Sword double playthrough. I will, well, it's more like solo run. I'll be skipping over the text unless it's uh, important, and the rules for this playthrough are. Easy. Uh, here they are. Um, we we will only be allowed to use double. Uh, I I'm gonna use my starter until I can catch double, and then I'm going to box my starter as soon as I can. Which will be a will be a little bit into the game. For my opponent, for which Pokemon I'm gonna pick. I, I think I'm going to pick, um, I think I'm going to pick Sobble, because Rillaboom is going to be really difficult in, uh, the, just throughout the game, and then there's also the Leon fight, it will give him a Cinderace, which we will not be able to outspeed, and which can carry moves like Low Kick and Pyro Ball. Which can do heavy damage to us. Um, as always, leave a like and consider subscribing. But only if you like the content. Uh, I mean, that's really the whole point of it, so. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I am on medicine that will make me cough a lot less. So. We got that going for us for the moment. Speaking of which. But yeah, we'll be trying to do a solo run. We'll be using Wooloo for the meantime, but as soon as we can, we're going to evolve it into a double. Now, I plan on not playing at all, unless it, I'm recording, so be, be prepared for the grind. And I'm not planning on going uh, several hours like some streamers have been doing, so. So this will be much more challenging. So, but I will be using XP candies, and I'll try not to power level for battles. But yeah, that knocks out all the, well, actually, the, that's the rules for the playthrough. So this is going to be interesting. I'm only going to be doing the main playthrough. <coughs> Excuse me. I will not be doing Crown Tundra or Isle of Armor. I do have that. But if this video... And the final video, I get, I'd say 16 likes. I'm going to, I will do uh, either the Crown Tundra or or the Isle of Armor, whichever one is more requested. But with the Isle of Armor, I will be use. I will have to use Cub Fu Song, 
because the battle tower and all that, which is a majority of the plot. But yeah. So, question today, what's your favorite normal type? The, what? So, if you can't tell, Wooloo Double are my favorite normal types, at least out of this generation. So, and we will be uh, trying to do max rates to get some TRs. Some will be absolutely critical for us to get, such as the TR for Zen Headbutt. We'll definitely need that. <clears throat> so, about, I want to say, five minutes. Five more minutes to get our first wool if we're lucky. But I will end this episode with us putting, you know, our excuse me, my our our sobble in the box. I forgot its name for a second. Jeez. <clears throat> so okay, that's right here. Yeah, place your bets on whether on if I can do this or not. Uh, this was inspired by uh, my dry bread. <coughs> Excuse me. If I knew how, I'd put a link in the description. But since I'm doing this on mobile, I have no idea how to do so. So that's gonna have to. I'll try and figure that out. But. Alright, we're right now we're just now getting to Leon. Alright. He does his signature pose. Alright. <clears throat> I've seen people do uh, I've seen people do runs of this game with only a Pikachu or an Eevee. So, I know it should be possible to do this with a uh, double, because double generally has better stats than both, but the people are also using the, <clears throat> the Gigantamax forms, and Pikachu is absolutely amazing. If you don't know, what it does is it makes it to where you can paralyze all opponents on the opposite side of the field. <clears throat> Excuse me. Alright. So, we'll be starting our adventure soon. I don't know if we'll be able to catch our Pokemon before Slumbering Wild. Not Slumbering. Yeah, Slumbering Wild. I hope we can. Because if not, this is going to get to the new series. I love how it had, uh, what's his name? Town form, space form. Flush on. There we go. Alright. While I do like Cinderace out of all of them, I will be going for Sobble. <clears throat> Excuse me. I plan on uh, getting some ROMs for older games. I, I think it'd be a, I think it'd be refreshing to step away from Gower just for a little bit. Possibly, I, I have a couple ideas of what game I, I'm planning on doing next. And I, I may do it alongside this series. God, that face. Alright. We're picking Sobble. No. Well, I'm not going to name it as soon as... 
As soon as we can, I'm gonna be throwing it directly. I'm gonna be throwing it directly in the box. I love how uh, he waits to see what we're gonna pick and then picks something weaker. So, it this game and the past couple games have been very handholding. I want the rivals who are super competitive, like what Bead is in this. <clears throat> ah, I forgot that he does that backwards. Oh well. I meant to pick it to where Grookey was gonna be fighting us all game, not Cinderace, but that will add some difficulty with Hop. And that his team changes with the starters, and Leon does too to some degree, but I don't know what exactly each team's gonna look like. Well, I have played with all three starters before. Not all at the same time, of course, different save files. Um, I cannot remember for the life of me what their team composition was. Oh well, I'm not gonna be Googling it, so. It, it's some added challenge. I already have an idea of how we're going to be able to hit Age Slash and other Dark Types. Not Dark Ghost Types. Ooh. Excuse me. Alright, we'll, we're just going to be uh, spamming Pound. Until we get water done. If I knew if there were if I knew if there were any emulators out for this game, I would have started one with a double. Because there's a the universal actually I'm not sure if the universal randomizer would work with this. Alright, we're, we learned water gun just for it to become important. I love how he was absolutely shocked by the idea that we're, we would even use something super effective, as if people didn't know that water puts up fires. <laughs> it kind of helps with uh, newer players, but again, I, I want. Rivals like Gary and Silver, and Silver, not in Pokemon Silver. I guess you should just get good. Alright. Uh, the Gym Challenge. Uh, Leon's telling us why we uh, aren't worthy, but since we have protagonist powers, we'll we'll get there. Yeah, we're, we're gonna get our starters later. Not our starters, but our double. I, I'm just gonna be running from everything. Hmm. Yeah, Sombering Weld looks really good. There's just not much to do here, honestly. Uh, again, we're just going to be running from things. If we can't run from it, we'll try and knock it out. But, yeah. <laughs> this is uh, kind of good because it gets to show off so many of the new Gower Pokemon. 
but in, in a way that you can't catch them, which I don't like. Because why show them off if you can't catch them? But. Oh, I accidentally. I was button mashing. But yeah, this will be probably the most challenging video uh, I've put out, at least as far as Let's Plays go. The competitive scene is a bit too much for me. Yeah. Alright. Just jumping right into the fog is great. Alright. Alright, well, let's see if we get anything from this. But with this, the some of the gyms are gonna be actually more challenging than in Shield. Which is why I decided to do this. Because we have to deal with Gordy, who is a rock type gym leader, who will be able to resist our phys our normal attacks. And well there's also the fighting tech gym. So we'll have our work cut out for us. But I, I do not plan on doing post game. You know, if we get 10 likes on this episode and the final one, or either really. Um, I'll do the post game with only my dub wool. I'm not sure if it's possible, but I'm definitely gonna try and do it. Alright, we we go we wake up in the forest. I love how it looks so realistic, the trees do. And then they really don't like the fairy trees and all that. They don't really look too realistic in my, in my eyes anyways. Alright. <clears throat> Let's see. I love how we walked in, blocked out, well lighted out, and uh Dub, not double, the wool is just fine. Oh well. Um, foreshadowing here. I think this is one of the first games, if not the only, um, yeah, if I'm not mistaken, uh, that you can counter the legendary before you even get your first badge. I know that there are exploits and all that, to actually, oh, I think I need to talk to my mom in here. Ugh. But yeah, we'll be able to get our double, not double, dang it. We'll be able to our Wooloo now. Uh, running slow, I can't wait till we get the bike. Even though that's on our way to the like second gym. Talking about the wild grass, and that's the building we need to go to. We will not be able to Ah here we go. I don't know if we have pokeballs, so that was stupid of me. Alright, let's see if I have any. If not, we will run from this fight. Alright, we have Pokeballs. Alright. I already have a name picked out for ours. Oh, that's gotta be Fluffy. Oh. Oh, that... that that's a mixed bag, actually. Whether it's good or bad. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, 
because Fluffy we trade our fighting weakness for fire and we don't really get too much coverage for fire types. I think we get rollout, but past that we don't really get anything. Alright, I already have a name picked out. We are going with Marshmallow. Yeah, Marshmallow. Had to make sure I was spelling it right. Alright. Let's see what we got to work with. Alright, we got Fluffy just as I thought. And I think we're, yeah, we're brave. Minus speed plus attack. It's kind of good, but at the same time. Speed's always nice. Sweet. Alright. Let's... We will not be able to... I don't think we'll be able to uh, just go directly to the Pokemon Center. Yeah, we will. Nope, that doubles, you know, that wolves in the way. We're going to have to go to the professor's place. All right. Took us like 20 minutes to get our first Wooly. That's ridiculous. But the challenge is now officially began. Bolton. No, not Bolton. Yamper. One of my favorite Gower Pokemon. I don't care much for a Bolton though. It's it's good, I guess. I wish they will have uh, kept the Corgi on its front. And well, it's pre-evolution. Let's see what we got. To well, actually, we'll. Meeting Sonya for the first time, blah, blah, blah. Um, after this cutscene, and we put our, we'll, we'll be able to put our Sobble into the box, which is good. I'm just about mentioning that. I'm, oh, we got the phone there, sweet. I love how it doesn't really give too much inside. At least the, at least the professor doesn't. All right, he gives the potion. Sweet, we can always use that. All right. Pokemon centers. At least they give us the option of we already know this. A lot better than uh, I butt mashed. Dang it, I don't want the tutorial. I wonder if there's any move or or stuff we can learn. Oh well. Alright, the run has officially uh, began, so uh, leave a like, consider subscribing. Uh, I'm going to end off here, question today, what's your favorite normal type? I think I really, I think double has to be my favorite, and uh, shout out to Staractor. But, until next time, I'll catch you guys later, peace.